Hey, how's it going everyone? So today we're going to be hopping into the Ultimate Red Zone. Um, they actually dropped last night. They're going to be releasing new stages of each edition, the movie edition and the GT edition. And then they're also going to be adding the Extremes, the Awakenings for these three free-to-play units, who I still have to grind up. Haven't really got around to that. I've been slacking, mostly link leveling and stuff like that. But uh, yeah, so part three is actually dropping here pretty soon. Um, sooner than I thought, at least. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and hop into the red zone. Now, I actually was going to try to beat Baby today, but as you can see, we already used our three tries, man. This guy is tough. I just keep getting caught, man. I think the team's strong enough when really it is not. Um, but yeah, what is, I think the last phase of this guy, yeah, both phases are AGL last phase. So we're actually going to be bringing five-year tech Vegito. Hopefully that's not a mistake. Uh, should be able to... I don't know, we'll just float him around, hope for his 50% dodge, and once he goes blue, maybe we'll keep him around, we'll see. Um, but this is going to be the team we're taking, uh, so hopefully it's good enough to get the job done. Uh, I know everybody who's tech other than him should be good. Um, then we've got the seven-year LRs, of course, but you know, once they lose their guard, man, they can definitely get blown out of the water in here. Um, so you definitely got to get... A lot of stacks in for them. It's about time I got a chance to fight. It's pretty obvious you're not going to defeat him by yourself. Sorry for the wait, Kakarot. For anyone you are, Vegeta. Alright, so we got the gods and the Super Saiyan 4s. So they both got their guard active here. Uh, we should be good to roll. Uh, let's, well, I don't really want to put them out front. Let's see, but these guys don't have prepared for battle. And they'll actually get their, um, their 24 key out there, so we're just gonna risk it for the biscuit. I know this guy's STR. So we do have type of disadvantage there, but I wanted to give the gods their 20 key at least so they'll get their guaranteed additional super attack. Um, so we'll go ahead and do this. Hopefully this guy doesn't super attack, and of course, look at this. Well, okay, that, uh, that's not that bad, honestly. I was expecting it to do a lot more. Thank goodness they're still guarding. Dude, because I'm a baby, I'm telling you guys. I mean, I'm sure you guys have probably already beat him. I'm just a pile at this game, you know, I don't know. He's tough, man. I keep getting caught, and it's not even the hardest stages to come. Man, he's like the fourth stage, and there's still three more. So, <laughs> I'm definitely excited to do some more red zone, but... Man, the seven-year LRs, man, they're good. They're Sometimes they're just not enough. They can definitely get wrecked like my super saiyan 4 is the last time i tried versing baby on his second phase his agl phase man they literally got supered for like 500k and then took like 100k punches and they had like over 400k defense rainbow seven year lr super saiyan 4s the friend i brought with me it just wasn't enough <laughs> they just 400k defense isn't enough, I guess. Like, <laughs> I don't know, man. It's it's tough. I definitely gotta have a some good RNG and some specific units to be able to, you know, tank it. Uh, so I guess we'll keep Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta right there. And then we're definitely gonna want Tech God Goku around on these last two phases against 13. But this guy should be dead this turn. All right, my man, Super Saiyan 4, Gogeta. We brought him along with us because he's tech, and he's actually a really good easy A. I do enjoy using him. I just did a showcase on him last night. Definitely a really good unit. He's putting up some big boy numbers. Getting the additional supers and stuff because I have 20 combo on him. All 
Nice. Now we got all three of these guys. I forget who has been stacking up and who hasn't. Man, these guys not having prepared for battle really kind of irks me. <laughs> like, we're not going to be able to get their additional super attacks here. Their 20 keys. Not even for these guys. They're getting three tech orbs and still not 20 key. Just their 18. We should be fine here, though. Heal up a little bit from those same type orbs. And then the Super Saiyan 4s. I don't know, man. If they get super attacked, it's... It might be GG right there, like, could definitely be game over. Let's see how they do, maybe their hidden potential uh, 5 combo can pop off for us, since mine are 55%. I wouldn't bet on it though. Let's see... Nope. Ooh, and 116k from a normal. Yeah, if he would have super attacked right there, we would have been dead. That would have been it. Yeah, I feel like they definitely should have gave him the Super Saiyan 4s prepared for battle, though, just to make him work at least a little better with the gods. Maybe that's too OP. I don't, I don't know. Damn, even type advantage, he still took 190k right there. Now he can't even fuse with uh, Gogeta here until our health is back up to where it needs to be. Um, yeah, definitely put Tech God Goku out there. He's not going to be taking any damage. And then we'll give all these guys these orbs. So we got an all-tech rotation. We should be fine here, even if he does su decide to super attack again. We should be all right. Yeah, I gotta get the other gods on rotation here with Tech God Goku. Then maybe I can float off Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta onto the other rotation. I don't know how we're gonna get Tech Gogeta to fuse though, man. Our HP is gonna have to be like above 80% or something like that. I mean, they're still good in their base forms, but. Especially if they're gonna like be double, triple super attacking. Raising up their defense some more, plus their damage reduction. It's pretty solid. Alright, we got five year anniversary Vegito Blue coming out. There he is. The man, the myth, the legend, he's gonna save us. Alright, we got some active skills as well. Um. Let's see, this guy doesn't have prepared for battle either, man. He's got over in a flash. What is this? All right, we can still give them their uh, their super attacks there. Man, am I really gonna float off the Super Saiyan 4s though? Like, I don't want to. I wanna stick him out front, but I, I can't, man. Yeah, I, I can't float them off. We got the Gogeta waiting to bust out here. We should kill him this turn. I don't think we're going to get any attacks in with the Super Saiyan 4s, though. Not with my gods with their dupe now. Oh, yeah, they're popping off. Yeah, there's the crit. They didn't even get the additional super there. Okay, now this, this is where things get sketchy. But we're not messing around here. It's time. Time to die, Fusion 13. Let's do this, Vegeta! Damn you! This is a power greater than that of a Super Saiyan God! I'm going to have fun destroying you! Alright, Super Android 13, Meet Blue Gogeta. Yeah! 
Yeah, now that's some good damage right there. We're gonna get them almost their 24 key right there. So they're already gonna be additional super attacking. Man, I'm really not gonna get a super attack with Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta here. Like, we, sh we, we could be fine this rotation, totally fine. If I was able to get a super attack with Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, he'd, he'd greatly raise his attack and defense. 50%, he'd be closing in on 300k, but I'm, I'm gonna have to take a Whis. You know, the two in, the two in slot one and two, uh, the gods, you know, and Super Saiyan God Goku, they would be fine. Unfortunately, I feel like Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, man, if he gets super attacked, we're dead. Well, we would've been fine. I think. Um, so we got a Whis active, so obviously this guy's taking double digits. Uh, you know, he's already got his 70% damage reduction when he's facing a movie boss or pure Saiyan, so... He's definitely a trump card on these movie boss stages, for sure. And then these guys putting up an 8.3. Oh, that's the friend one. Oh boy. Yeah, it's gonna be a crit, their additional 5.96. Yeah, man, once you get to this part of the fight, it's honestly not too bad. This stage is easier than Baby, for sure. With Tech God Goku, man, Tech Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, you got the Tech Gods, you're, you're good to go, I think. Plus, uh, Tech Gogeta here, man, it's, yeah. Yep. Let's do this, Vegeta! Yeah, this stage is way easier than Baby, man. What the heck? Let's fuse, Kakarot. You're the last person I expected to suggest fusing. This is going to be special. I can feel it. Fusion. Ah! I'm neither Goku nor Vegeta. Yeah, we're gonna finish him off right here, man. I've had enough. It's time to unleash my most devastating attack. I'll finish you off with this. Ultra Big Bang. Yep. There's the guaranteed crit. We didn't even have to use the other, the blue boys' as active skill there. Wow, first try on Fusion Android 13. Easily beaten. But Baby? Dude, he's been giving me some trouble. I've ran his stage, like, at least ten times now. Trying to record a video of me beating Baby with that team that I was trying to use. I'm actually, I've been trying to, well, I can't even look at my friend's team until this resets, but yeah, man. We'll get it eventually. I'll upload a video, uh, of us taking down Baby. Um, but yeah, this was the team to take down Fusion 13. Honestly, Blue Vegito didn't even do anything that run, really, <laughs> other than transform. I, I don't even know why we brought him. We literally could have brought anyone else, but he was tech, so... Didn't really need to do any work for us, but yeah, this team worked out pretty good. Tech God Goku is an awesome EZA, along with Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. The gods were just looking good there against his last two AGL phases, and then, you know, we can just fuse with these guys, and it's GG. Yep, that stage is definitely a lot easier than Baby, but we'll eventually be able to beat Baby here. I'll get a video uploaded at some point. Um, but alright guys, let me know how the anniversary is going for you guys. Let me know what you want to see next. Hope you guys are ready for part 3. But as always, I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.